What's going on YouTube? This is Mr. Scott01 coming to you with another fragrance review. Today we're looking at one from Anishio Parfums. But before we do that, let's roll my music. Now, before we get started, make sure you like, share, subscribe, so I can keep keeping this nice, fresh content coming to you. Now, I said we were looking at one from Initio Parfums, and the one from Initio Parfums is no other than Initio Parfums Side Effect. I've been trying to get my hands on this one for a while. It's a very classy presentation on the outside. You have a nice purple, velvety feeling Outside, you have initial side effect. Let me turn that around. Initial side effect on the top with a gold plate. Very nice. And also a gold plate on the front. I will say, even if the juice wasn't good, which it is, hey, this is a very classy bottle. This one comes in a 3.04 ounce 90 mil bottle. And this one costs around $300, but it's very well blended. And I believe it's worth every dollar. Not only is this bottle nice, but the packaging is gorgeous as well. Very sturdy. I know some of you don't like the packaging or whatever like that and throw it away. Hey, I did in the beginning too. For me as a collector, it completes the whole vibe of everything. In the beginning of this one, you get this Mike and Ike fruit candy type vibe. Like you just stuck your nose in a box of Mike and Ikes. Then almost immediately, like I said, 10 seconds later from this one, you start to get that rum note that they're talking about. You have vanilla in this that just gives it just a hint of sweetness, not overbearing. But like I said, they, they really blended this one very well when they did this. Then you have tobacco that slowly starts to come in and it just sits in the background through the whole presentation. Then also you have spice in this one. Uh, it's listed as just having vanilla, but I believe there's a little bit more than vanilla in here. It's a nice, not peppery spicy but like a like a cinnamon toast crunch type vibe um and when i say that don't take that literally i'm just saying it's a very warm and cozy scent and i recommend this for any age group any age group i would recommend you stick to the night with this one mm, very nice let's take a look at the itemizer Oh yeah, they got down with that itemizer. It's very nice too. You're gonna get compliments with this one. For me, this one right here lasts a total of eight plus hours, at least eight hours. If you, if you have it on the shirt as eternal, you're gonna get about four hours of good long lasting projection. And this is gonna set you apart. It doesn't have a lot of notes, but it's very well blended. And like I said, I think it's more to this than what they're saying. With initial parfums, their line is meant to be mixed with a lot of their other fragrances like Magnetic Blend number one through seven, eight. I forgot how many they are, but take a look at it. This is a very interesting house. My goal is to get hold of every last one from this line. I have two other ones from this line that I will be getting to very shortly. Um, I don't know about tonight. Um, <laughs> as you can see, my uh, schedule has been a little bit busy lately, um, but I love you all and I got to make time for you. Well, you've got my opinion on this one. Now, let's get the official note breakdown of Initial Parfums Privé. That's the whole name of this one. Side Effect. Let's do it. This is the information off of the Initial Parfums website. It says the main notes are cinnamon bark, rum, tobacco, saffron, sandalwood, and hedion. But the site also speaks of leather and vanilla. Hey, my YouTube family, thank you for sticking with me. We're at a little over 680 subscribers. I'm trying to make it to that thousand subscriber mark. Please stay tuned for more things to come. Please like, share, subscribe if you haven't. And uh, we're going to keep it rolling. Like I said, uh, I got a few more from Initial Parfums that I want to review. But I'm telling you, this one right here is, is the best of the ones that I got, in my opinion. Um, but, 
Hey, you be the judge.